hi guys welcome uh, in this video we will talk about dom based xss so let's start same ip address web for test lab in this series the example number 9 is dom based xss vulnerable to dom based xss so let's check that how we can do okay first of all i want to tell you that dom in dom based accesses data is sent to the browser not to the server means when a user type or uh, told some input to the browser it does not send to the uh, server it's only fetch the data and turn to the client and uh, user at the same time it use hashtag it use hash so let's talk here if we add buzzer nothing okay first of all i want to show you the view page source here at the end check script document dot write location dot hash that substring okay now check this <clears throat> here in the console body here if i type like as script let one script if we press enter there will nothing no, because it is showing at this stage okay script here document dot write location dot hash substring okay if we copy this and paste into here let me show this again document sorry document dot write location dot hash dot substring hash dot substring then one if we press here enter a pop-up will appear it's mean it is vulnerable to dom based sss dom based cross site scripting you have to put this code at this area so this was all about dom based sss another example we want to take we will use firing range So public firing range app spot address DOM XSS. If we click click this, here is a location dot hash document right. Okay here if we type hash and then as buzzer nothing now if okay now go to public firing range dot .com. here are some different vulnerability vulnerabilities like as address dom xss redirect xss you may use this also this is also an exercise for you redirect access reflective access 
tag based accesses escape accesses dom accesses again so let's try this here are different various javascript functions that we may use them first of all we will use this okay here as i have already told you that dom baked ssh is used in those sites dynamically that you that are using hash in their url so if we type here hash svg load onload is equal to alert one and if we press enter then it will show us as a pop-up mean this is also vulnerable to down baked sss so there are some other exercises their examples you must have to do it at your own time so it will give you a lot of uh, it will give you a lot of practice and it will give you a lot of experience so you must do it in your own time in the next and the last video of the exercise we will talk about some prevention and we will talk about that how we may use uh, some external code or some other code to prevent these XSS attacks. Thank you for watching this video. We will meet you in the next lecture.